a swell tulsia uh pactum tulla whale it is saturday today we had a lot of technical difficulties we did manage to get a meeting up and running uh, zoom kept crashing for some of us so i decided to also do excuse me <coughs> another video and go through what was there and let's start and open with prayer oh chicha siam if you watch your screen i've actually brought it up here oh chicha siam please to skeps it a quam quam cha to lee so squala whale well i'm cool eat to tilt tell a whale a quest hack will let sit to see west to see aliquas cheat on a set lam comic stam a quest the ass mok tells the call all my relations so today we were working with the phonics chart i have them here here's the phonics chart and i'm going to go through the phonics chart as well as post on the group and what is important for study one of the things we did go over when i was starting to work with the language this is how i practiced it was almost very important to practice in this fashion it is how the elders taught the way i understand it and one would get corrected if you didn't say it the way the phoneme chart works so over on the left over here you will see i've adapted it for use online there's the sound e e balam to emek emek is for walking so over here on this side and hopefully you can see my now it turns into a white cursor there's that sound e balam to emek emek is for walking next one ah there's the sound ah balam to amat amat is to sit sit up sit down ah there's your sound ah balam to aha aka is to is for canadian goose so i had audio files and it seemed to me i would try to do a zoom file that i don't have to do a conversion on I'm going to try to make this a little bigger and I'm going to read through this. That's if I can get it bigger. And our heaths soon, not long we will have it together here. Okay, so right now I'm going to read through these for you. The phoneme chart I will upload to the group. This over here goes through as well it shows on the phoneme chart as well and it will have all of that on there that i'm reading i don't know why the header is opening and closing e walam ta imak imak is for walking ah walam to amat amat is to sit sit up sit down ah walam ta aha Aha is for Canada goose. U walam to tukwas. Tukwas is for nine dollars. Ah walam to alf. Alf is to get into. I'm just gonna have to pause and take a drink. <coughs> I've been <coughs> all day so far online and uh, in groups and online meetings. Let's try that again. Ah walam to alf. Alf is to get into. O walam to stalo. Stalo is for nine dollars. M walam to musmus. Musmus is for cow. Ch walam to chalik. Chalik is for hand. Ch walam to ch ehut. Ch ehut is for drying something pa walam to patakwam patakwam is for bracken fern this is a popping sound and i'm hoping it comes through clear enough put your lips together and you try to blow out through them walam to 
AUKUS. AUKUS is for bald eagle. Ah, Lamta. Sopples. Sopples is for 10 o'clock. So those were the two we covered today. I'm going to stop right there on those for a moment. And then we're going to go over here and I'm going to go through the session itself. So Kaitzthal and Lolil and Tam and everybody, McQuap, everybody who got on there with us and some were only getting audio. I'm going to go over this as well. So a quest a me. McQuat. Up river Halkamalum Kulskap. A quest and me. Welcome. McQuat. Up river. Actually Qua should be in there. Up river Halkamilum Kul the Scap. River Helkamilum call is Upper River Helkamilum language and the gathering. So welcome everyone. Upper River Helkamilum language and gathering. Here's some of our, our our words we were working with again today, and I think we're going to keep trying to do this until we work out Zoom and our voice registration and hearing each other. Milt Quitmilum, come inside. Milf, quit wheelum, Elsiea, come in, my friend. I could say to you, quick with that. How do you say, come inside, vita halkamilum call, in the halkamilum? Oh, well, the answer would be, milt quit wheelum. And that's somebody buzzing to see what else we're doing with language today. I'm going to run some of these tapes. We also worked with what I worked with and developed for the elders because we were kind of at a table. And we had to do something that sometimes did not require a lot of physical activity and it appears to be working online. So this is something you can just even do with yourself. I have used the word mystique, which is person, people. So person or people one, let's a one, as well as with you, a sala, person two. So I'm going to go through the Hohal Siwalam. I call it my icebreaker game. It's based on knock knock who's there. So right here, Hohals, I will start and it's going to be interesting because I got to stop with the mouse. Hohals, Hohals. If I was at your door right now, I could say a latif, good morning, a swale, good day, a took swale, afternoon, a qualalt, evening. Let's try again. I'm going to play both parts. Qualals, qualals, a latif. Now I got to change my voice. So Misty, you too would say, twa quali quatha. Who's there? Tawat quali kwasa. Who's there? Tawat to squee. What's your name? Well, what would we answer? We would answer with our names. I would say, Kai tell squee. What's that person at their door? We've been knocking. They say, Tell a let's a chuch. And that's that can be tricky. That. E-X-W. It's not really an ook sound. It's more of a breathy sound. Tell a it's a tuch. Where are you from? And I would have to tell them. Talitzel qua altalio. Talitzel qua altalio. I am from Ontario. Hui Lewis, your turn. Try to go back through that. Rewind the video. Do a little bit of practice. Some of the other activities that we've worked with the last few days for online are li chukwa ea, which basically says, are you fine? Or how are you? Here's two. We have person one again. Oop, oop, don't do that. Do a redo on there. We have person one. Oh, it's still doing it. Oh, we're learning the technology. And person two. 
So person one, a swale, lichukwa ea, good day, how are you? A swale, lichukwa ea, good day, how are you? Selwa ea titama, castalua. Selwa ea titama, castalua. I'm fine. I, I'm doing okay. I'm fine. Chitama, thank you. Kaos is used under certain circumstances to mean and. There's other ways to say and, but in this case, when we're talking to people and formal sort of conversations between people, we would use the word kaos. And you. So what would the answer be? I would have to say, sell wa'ea. I'm fine. Thank you. And here is a longer version that we'll work with, and sometimes the tongue gets twisted on it. Quetzalmetzalcha. See you soon. And we can just say Quetzlama. Oh, goodness. My allergies are acting up. There are two ways as well to say goodbye in Upriver Helcomelum. One is Lamaweth. Lamaweth said to the person leaving. Howaweth said to the person staying. One of the other activities we worked through in this sheet was Li Chukwaea. And then I would ask who was there. Tem was there. Kaitstol was there. Li Chukwaea Tem. And he would have to tell me. How are you doing, Tim? What's his answer? He might have been sleepy. Itatum sell. I'm sleepy. Tetzel OA. I'm good. Tetzel OA. And Kaitstol, who I, I love dearly, and, and I just, my hands go up to him. I think he was talking about it was close to lunch. We off always. Kwakwi. Sell. I'm always hungry. We can also say quay. We could say we off quay sell. And me, I feel lately like many of you. You could sell. Busy I am. I might even say we off. You could sell. I'm always busy. We went through a few others here. You've heard. I'm going to read these over. Uh, I think they're fairly self-explanatory in, in the online curriculum. Lee Chukwa Ea, who we're talking to. Maybe it was Tam, it might have been Lolil, it might have been Kaitsto. And I asked, Lee A Ta Sita, did you sleep well? There's some answers here. Awa, no. Ah, -ah yes. Yaswa, maybe. And I added this in because if we wanted to say maybe, maybe there was a reason. Yaswa. Eat it themselves. Maybe I was tired. Sometimes when we're really tired, we don't always sleep well. Maybe. Selkwakwi. I was hungry, so I didn't sleep well. What if we're going to ask that again? Li a tasita, did you sleep well? Awa, sell uquis. I was busy. So, real quick, we will run through the rest here. Here's the phonics chart shows again for you. It's all in this one document. I guess I did that. That's good. Tetzalo A. Um, down here is the really a good way to practice it. It will help you learn not only the sound, e, kolamta, which can be understood as sounds and for emic. So e is for emic, shows in a word example. And then you also, when you're learning it this way, you actually are coding in a translation for yourself in your own studies. Emic is for walking. E walam to emic. Emic is for walking. A walam to amat. Amat is to sit up, sit down. 
And if you forget those first two lines, if we go back up here for a moment. Ooh, it's here someplace. I've put in some of your sounds. E. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ooh. Here, I, I, I put the Y in brackets. Ah. Uh, oh. So you can work through those two lines as well. We'll go down a little further. We'll go past that. And I believe in here is some other of the rescue phrases that we practiced yesterday. We didn't go through all of them in our, even our online class time. We're working with the, um, oh, I guess it's the free Zoom for right now is what you would call it. Some of our rescue phrases. Our cell lil look alma look alma. There's two or three different ways in dialects to say that, but awa, there's our awa, and it's spelt here with that particular o instead of that e. Awa cell lil. That's part of our negation that you know we'll get to and discuss with the grammar. Look alma. I don't understand. And what I really like is this one here is Latzel. I put it in phonetic. Malkaluch. That luch, that EXW is a blowing sort of sound, just like in chuch. Latzel Malkaluch. I forgot how to say yes. Ah uh ah. -uh. Latzel Malkaluch. Yes. And then the answer would be how do I say that? Ah uh ah. -uh. Yes. So here are a few more that we have gone through already. Awa, no. Ah, ah, yes. Yaswa, maybe. Siu, when we opened in prayer, I used that word, please. We've seen this already too. Selchitama, which is a way to say thank you as well. Kwasai. Ah, ah, with. It's another word. You're welcome. Key Lewis, your turn. And yesterday we just started working with a few verbs. Quayul set. So quayul means ah, there, there, there we go. Quayul happy. And set is actually our pronoun right there for us. So happy us. And in English we would say we are happy. But the to be verb does not show in many indigenous languages. So we see the verb first, and then we see the pronoun attached. So these are very simple sentence structures. Schwat, schwat, chap. You folks are smart, smart you folks. Schwat, set, we are smart. I think I'm gonna wrap it right about there right now. Down here, I've added a few here for our pronoun cell I. Chuch, you, set, we, or us. Chap is usually translated as you folks. There is actually a word for them, but you folks, it's when it's, it's like a direct personal pronoun. You'll find a few other things in this as well. I'm gonna upload this again. And my next question today was tuat to see a Word tuat means who, essentially who, who, your friend. And I hope you say Kai. So for right now, we will wrap this up. I'll get this up on the group site. Muktelskaka. Muktelskaka. All my relations. And a cha to swale. Have a good day, my friends. <laughs>